check, 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 okay. Today, very, very, very quick news about few coins, about what to check in incoming, uh, on upcoming, on upcoming altcoin season and what is going on with Bitcoin plus how we're supposed to look at dominance, okay? So there's going to be few coins and few interesting news about watch your watch out on your coins when you have them on Binance. Let's go. So hello to 321 Crypto. Uh, let's go, my name is Matthew, and today today and always I'm gonna be your host, so there is no financial advice here. It's only news and media and ent entertainment. So let's quickly go to Bitcoin, and we can see the Bitcoin is now going sideways. We can see this here in our levels, and what I'm hoping is to see Bitcoin creating that sort of triangle then we may have an action upwards. And why I'm think, thinking so? Because if we're going to take a look at Bitcoin dominance, we can see that this dominance is trying to escape higher. So look, there is nothing here. So this movement could be very fast up to 60, kind of 62%. And then we could see the retrace, let's say here. So this retrace will be our alt season exactly our alt season then if we're gonna take a look at other uh, so altcoins altcoin dominance we could see that altcoin dominance have finished a wave a and now it's doing or one or one or now it's doing b or two and then we're gonna prepare for c so if bitcoin dominance will go up altcoin dominance will go here at this retest and then while bitcoin dominance will go down altcoins will pump and i'm hoping this could even happen in march so we are entering march at the moment when i'm recording this episode and if we're gonna go to monthly we have a new candle now and we went so high in this one and i'm thinking that we could start even <laughs> generating this idea why I'm talking about head and shoulders? I'm going to show you now. So a lot of coins are now breaking their necklines and they create some called head and, shoulder, head and shoulders, let's say cup and handles and different patterns. While these coins are breaking, okay, they try to fulfill this entire cup. And I'm going to show you a few coins that <laughs> they did this already. Okay. So if we're going to take a look at, for example, at, for example, uh, let's say even fetch AI look fetch AI looks very 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 good retest and bam okay close this neckline okay fetch AI another coin that we can take a look is Aggie Aggie as a actually Aggie did this thing here that's the neckline Aggie just break broke to the ne uh, this neckline and now look Aggie did full um, full return to its full position here creating this big cup so that's this movement they, they look like this you know we just didn't we just didn't um, get used to it to this after this two years of uh, falling but now this is happening this is happening so watch out uh, at this coins look at the Litecoin is breaking up now watch out Litecoin when the Litecoin will try to uh, do this pattern we could see we could see exponential growth to Litecoin up to even, I don't know, 500. Well, Litecoin didn't do 200. Yeah, Litecoin went to, to almost 400 last time. So if we could go here and we could break out, that's going to be a new market cap for entire crypto. So crypto capitalization could go to, I don't know, 6 trillion. <laughs> that's something. So we have a Litecoin, we have an Aggie, and we have IOI from the gaming industry. We could take a look at IOI, IOI, one second, IOI, where is it? Um, Illuvium, oh yeah, another one is Illuvium. 
Illuvium is also trying to fulfill this neckline and then fulfill this. I don't know, maybe we're going to see Illuvium for 500. I don't know. I don't know. They could lead this uh, movement as well. So IOI, where is it going? Yeah, there it is. Look, it looks very nice with this flag. Watch out, watch out. I don't know what's happening on IOI, but it could break to the upside. And from three, three cents, we could see something like a 13 or even 24. So note that in your diary, okay? In your diary. Um, another coin who, which is pumping now is Farcana. Farcana has a news uh, there that something will happen after one day. So something will happen today, today. And also, uh, Ross, uh, not, not RSC. Oh yeah, uh, Ross, uh, Rossnet is creating now a higher low. So we could start pumping again, okay? They have been listed on XEGX and now maybe we're gonna see another listing somewhere else or another piece of technology. But look, Rosnet did the same thing. And Rosnet is inside this uh, GPU calculation, modeling, graphic, and so on, okay? So as you can see, this is very crucial because a lot of chips were sold already. And this power, this GPU high-grade uh, power is now accounted in Amazon, who is charging a lot, a lot of fees. And we have a possibility using crypto AI markets to gain these functionality for small projects. So they can buy cheaper power for their projects. Okay, they don't have to pay Amazon. That's the whole beauty. And um, watch out on these projects. They, I see that they are they are exp ex expanding, you know, they are expanding. Another project from that sort of um, uh, cloud computing and so on is Golem. Golem is with us since forever, since forever, okay? Since forever, 2017 start, you see, 2017. So now Golem has a ready to go market and full functionality of Golem token. Now Golem is a big player. It's like 400, I think, millions market cap. But once the golem will be discovered, because everything is there, full power is there, um, market functionality is there, token usage to buy uh, GPU power is there, nobody's talking about golem. So golem could even go again, okay? Breaking neckline, look, cop and handle, okay? And it could reach, let's say $2, for example, if this trend AI and the power will actually um, uh, be in demand. Okay, be in the mat. So um, um, that's how we can see the coins. And another coins is Vai. Look, pure copy of uh, Fetch AI. Look at Vai. Look at Fetch AI. Look, very similar. Look, very similar. Bam, 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 bam. So I'm looking at Vai as well. And remember, all these coins you can buy at KuCoin. 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 KuCoin, KuCoin. Link is below, okay? Don't miss the KuCoin because KuCoin is exchange for this uh, bull market because it has all these um, AI coins, all which are on exchanges, okay? New ones are on DEXs, but probably they're gonna be listed as well <clears throat> on KuCoin. So let's go to the news, okay? Bam, 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 nothing to see here. Everything is green, okay? Everything is green. I like this ma these memes, look. Nobody wants to beat, no, 15, no. No way. That's a typical street. Bam. <laughs> I love these ones. Hong Kong is going to eliminate all exchanges before uh, final deadline of registrations. So all exchanges will going to face the deadline on... Uh, the deadline will be on May 31st. If the if exchange will not going to uh, apply, they're gonna be excluded, uh, I mean, throw out from the country. So all these exchanges gonna apply for it. And that's my question. What will happen with these other exchanges which will not going to apply? So maybe we're gonna be having a force of KYC on every exchange. That's gonna be very interesting because then watch out on DEXs. Well, sorry, watch out for DEXs. DEXs, I think they're gonna be pumping because people will gonna use DEXs. Uh, look, BlackRock, 
is attacking now Brazil with uh, uh, ETF. So look how many people are going to go in this super cycle. But I think the super cycle will be quicker. And then the big question, whether we're going to face maybe nine months of a bear market. I don't know. We'll see. Japan, very interesting. Japan is losing its uh, personnel, I would say, people. Okay. Um, there are not many new comers in a Japanese um, uh, market. Uh, so, uh, population market, sorry. So, that's very interesting what's happening there. Like, um, you know, people say, oh, well, we can't do anything. But, um, yes, you can. The bad policies about our life are now resulting in uh, mass exodus of people. Like, uh, you can always do something. You can always play with the value of people. Now, this is very interesting. Look, uh, this uh, doom... Uh, uh, Doom XBT person. I, I think it's a girl. I think it's a. Uh, I have been compromised in some strange way, uh, uh, and my Binance account was drained out. Out of nowhere, I heard sound notifying about orders getting filled while never placed any order. Okay. Suddenly, my 70k amount uh, was suddenly zero. So she lost everything. And I saw, I knew it's coming extremely wrong. Something was extremely wrong. So uh, when she was actually looking at this, somebody was executing the trades and somebody took the loan. She had the identity verification, KYC was done. Two-factor authentication was done. And she even uh, have a pass case in UBK as well. That's strange, UBK. So uh, then she saw that someone was taking loans, okay, on, on this. And then everything was just going down. And the funny thing was when she called the support, suddenly the amount was retrieved. And now I'm going to show how useless supports are, how brainless in corporations. So support, she was asking about support and support was checking the account. Then support was insisting her to connect with the video call so they can verify that she is she. Suddenly she saw that her uh, last amount is disappearing. So she pressed a uh, scam report and uh, what the support did? Support insist on video call. <laughs> That's it. So um, after she, they verified her, I think it's her, okay, I'm gonna use her. Uh, support says that, oh yeah, they are confirming that the amount was uh, withdrawn from Binance. Like that's a typical corporation response. That's why I am strong in my opinion. Corporations will never succeed with uh, exceeding the Excel quality, never. And I can submit kind of even a bet on it. Never, never. They say never, say never. But uh, I have seen a lot of incorporations. I was dealing with corporations myself. I was dealing with the supports there. And uh, it's just a random answers. Okay, random answers. So I don't know what happens here. Okay, someone was saying that it also happened on KuCoin twice, someone said. And he said, this person here said that they were, she, uh, this person was using Brave Browser, okay, and it has a malware in uh, extension. So if she was using malware, then protect your computer at all costs, okay? Don't use shitty antivirus, some sort of cheap uh, or even free, and don't use one. Also equip yourself with some anti-malware, and I'm going to, maybe advertise here malware bytes, okay? Um, and have something from it, you know? Have, have, have something because <laughs> <coughs> installing shit software is bad luck. Like. But she had a superb, um, um, superb, uh, uh, like a USB key security on the Binance and still it was flagged out. I don't know what, what this support was doing. They should retrieve their amount because once she reported that the transfer is getting out, they should freeze the entire account straight away. Freeze and then try to do something. And they didn't. Useless. Somebody here was a useless cunt, just like that. So I think Binance should at least give her back this 40 wherever grant. If not, Binance is not the same as after CZ. It's a new quality of uh, so-called regulated and, and protective Binance. Yeah. So that's why when we're going to see, first of all, these uh, Hong Kong um, uh, applications 
and every exchange will gonna have to be on the KYC. Uh, then we see poor quality of support in Binance because that's the poor support in Binance. Okay, there is a fact. Okay, even if the money was probably uh, maybe um, uh, compromised by her poor quality of security, maybe I don't know. Still, still support should react straight away. They didn't. So for me, it's poor. Okay, and um, remember that you are the only one who will look after your security. So Padre is a new generation of trading on DEXs and now is partnering with Overdose. And I think then the big inflow will be on uh, Padre. So if you're going to be using DEXs and Padre will accommodate more chains, that's going to be super. Okay, watch out because there is a pre-sale going on in March. Uh, subscribe to Padre, <clears throat> uh, to Padre uh, Twitter and attempt at this pre-sale because Padre could be really, really hype project uh, when it comes to uh, trading. Another meme, Jesus, another meme, we have to take a look at this, okay? So, you know, here there are plenty of text about this thing, you probably see, have, see, you probably have seen that uh, meme. So, about Bitcoin, no, he doesn't want to call, you know, talk about the Bitcoin. He bought the Bitcoin at 69 and now it's 20, so he's fed up with this, he wants to sell and all his friends wants to sell. <coughs> Of course, he doesn't say this, you know. Eh? Hey, the B Bitcoin, no, the Bitcoin is now 65. 65? $65, yeah. Halving is coming, 2024. Bitcoin will go to 100,000. I like this man. I like this man. That's why crypto is like, nobody understands us. You know, nobody understands us. Like we are, we are degens in a normal society. Normal society. Another project blocks, but watch out, okay? It's a very fresh and new project, very fresh. It reminds me Diak, who is now really in the question marks. And uh, watch out. I uh, invested in this project. You can buy this at Maxis, yeah, at Exchange. And it looks like it's, uh, you know, designed to diverse, uh, manage, prioritize, secure, and efficiency. And in their phase two, they will deliver also GPU power as well, okay? About the data transfers and then so on. So um, you, can, you can see this, um, <coughs> you can see this, <coughs> this uh, graph here, look, <coughs> and um, I don't know, looks, looks like a um, consolidation for me, but watch out because uh, the GitHub is showing kind of small results, very poor website, and uh, I don't know. Could be something, could be nothing. Could be something, could be nothing. So it's only 8 million market cap and um, and it's a new project, okay? And it's a new project. Watch out, <clears throat> watch out. So I will finish on this. Uh, write down these coins, check them yourself and see if they're going to be good for you. Take care and see you tomorrow.